Hello everybody and welcome back yet again to Metroid Prime Trilogy. Mm -hmm. Yay. You didn't already blow that up. Oh, and I can just miss that. Ever. Yes, you can, sir. And that is a beetle that we had to kill for our power-up. Well, it, it's uh, presented as a boss for... Uh, or, geez, I can't think. Morph ball. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We had to. We had. We have had to kill it. This makes three times, I think, four times, something like well, that. Well, this is just kind of what spawns here now. Yeah, instead of beetles. But we have to kill it. This is the second time we've had to kill it in order to access a power up. Yeah, that's what oh, I was trying to say. We don't have enough missiles to get. Um, you should wave just busted. like. Oh you should just God. use wave beam. I don't want to. Because you're you are really bad at this right now. I I shouldn't be either. You are you are not doing well, sir. And he's a magician. And you need to you need to dodge left and right more and just shoot a super missile at its ass or something. Probably not a bad idea. Cause cause then it'll circle around and lock on. Wow. Wow. I'm okay. Him. Wow. That, you should really use Wave Beam. <laughs> you are not doing too that well. That wasn't my fault. That, that was your fault. Not, you the, shot su it not the, the super missile part. You shot that it. That was the, the super missile's fault. No, you shot it the you shot at the wrong time. I'm just gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna say that. Yeah. That's that is my excuse. What the oh, I was gonna be like, what the hell? Where's the power up? <laughs> Where'd it go? Where is it? Are all the are all of them missing now? Oh, hey, look, another power-up. I remember, uh, was it Wave Beam was in there? Uh, Grapple. Grapple, that's what it was. Randomizer. Come on, I can... It's not right there, is it? I saw, um, I saw Miles, um, uh, I saw him use the Morph Ball bombs to get that, yeah. instead of, uh, Boost Miles Ball. is a god. That it, yeah, I was really impressed. It took him, like, seven or eight different tries, but... At the same time, taking seven or eight tries to use bombs and not Jesus. boost ball to get up there. I'm trying to remember where the ru which direction the ruined shrine is. Why is that door gray? Which oh, it's a missile door. That's why it's gray. But we already broke it with a missile. Yeah. I don't understand. Sometimes it just kind of loads. Oh, we can get to that thing. The the, the wave thing. buster. Yeah, we can uh, just let's just we fill up on missiles. I don't think we can. Uh, I don't think we have enough missiles. Let's. Well, uh, I think it's like sixty. No, no you, you need, need 40, forty. If you do it perfectly, because there's eight of them that you need to break. I think I'm gonna go this way just in case. Aww. I know. Gonna get more missiles. Missiles. Yeah. I think there's one at the ship that we still haven't gotten. Yeah, it's back under the ship. <laughs> back behind it. The 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 wrist flick fails, though. Yeah. That I mean, happens. I've been playing way too much of the GameCube version of this. I can tell. I can tell. I am so I am gonna I am gonna give you so much shit today. That's fine. That is a beehive. Yep. Or well a wasp hive, I should say, because it's more wasps. Nobody cares what they are, all they know is that they sting you. And they're annoying. Yep. Boop boop boop. Boop, 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 boop. You really don't need to flick that hard, bro. Yeah. I'm just saying. Just, just. I'm just gonna throw it through the ceiling one of these times. Awesome. Especially since you don't have the wrist strap on. Yeah, that's right. I just said he doesn't have the wrist strap on. Half of you are gonna hate me, and half of you are gonna be like, "Really, Asa? You wear the wrist strap?" <laughs> and I'm gonna be like, "Yeah, because I don't feel like throwing the Wii Remote at the screen." There's plenty of good pictures of that happening, so. There's plenty of actual times I've thrown the Wii Remote at the screen sometimes, accidentally and on that. purpose. <clears throat> I'm I'm not like flaily enough to do that. Yeah, that's that's true. You don't flail enough. Flail more. Okay. Oh, that's right. There's that one. Yep, there's that one. I that's one of the few that I missed in my run through this. That's, I can imagine why. You just never came back here. Yeah. There's no real need to, aside from that. And this one, right there. That's a, that's a good one to grab. I think we could have technically gotten that in, or as right, soon we got as we got, because yeah. we can flick, flick our way through everything. Mm -hmm. So that's something I like. They may have closed a bunch of routes, 
with uh, speedrun stuff, but by adding the flick to the Morph Ball, they made it a lot easier to just, as soon as you get Morph Ball unlocked, or not unlocked, but grab a bunch of stuff that you couldn't before. Like that you would have to place one bomb Definitely to get to. <laughs> yeah. It kills them in one shot, because it hits them three times, huh? Technically, yes. Yeah. I, I just, like, I'm pretty sure each of those wave shots does half as much as a um, power beam. So, so you're doing 150% damage. Yeah, basically, with a single shot. Whereas, like, plasma does, like, six times the damage. Yeah, something it's ridiculous not like that. that. It's not that high. It's ridiculous, though. It's, it's a pretty good... Yeah, it's, it's a good chunk. It's a huge chunk. Okay, so how many missile missiles do we have? We have 65 total... Okay. But, like, or that's our max, and then right now we've got, like, 50. Okay. About 56. 56. That'll do. There's two missile tanks in this room, though. Awesome. Let's get them both. Yep. I think Oop. this is another one I forgot in my playthrough. Possibly. Oh, I remember. <laughs> I was impressed when, um... When you did the randomizer, and you, uh, the, the, was it the ice beam was underneath of the bridge where the wait, ice buster usually is? No, what was it under the bridge? I, I want to say it was a missile tank, but we he got didn't, stuck he didn't have in there. He didn't have space jump boots, and he managed to get out. I'm going to end up uploading that randomizer run. Yeah, that, that was, was really awesome. I, was, I had a lot of fun with that one. That was a really good one. Yeah, that was... I was, I was been, very I've impressed. I've been playing it all week, though. Yeah. So I, I imagine that it luck was finally on your side or something. It happened, like, twice. And technically, you can win any of those runs as long as you're... Good enough? Yeah. Because, like, there's a few wall crawls and stuff that you can do with the morph ball that are... I just don't have the skill to do. Um, I, yeah, that, I suppose that's... I'm already in wave beam. You are indeed, because you recognize it is better than power beam. <laughs> Un unless you want super missiles, in well, which case... In which case, power beam is probably better. Yeah, every one of the beams has their advantage. That's true. Or advantages, in, in the case of in wave plural. beam. I am, obviously, a strong advocate for it. You get a bias. I, I am not biased. I have preferences. Pew! There's only a small difference between a bias and a preference. Pew! Yeah, that's true. Hey, I'm not racist. I hate everyone equal. Wow! Yep. yep Why yep, did you jump? Yep. Yep. Why did you jump there? I don't, was, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. It was not this. necessary, sir. No. <laughs> oh, maybe really? you do need 60. Yeah, you do. I, I lied to you, sir. You do need 60. That's alright, we had more than 60 before we came in here. Yeah. I'm just saying, though, that, like, I thought you needed 40 to do it perfectly, and you needed more. Don't, 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 don't fuck up. I fucked up. You fucked up. You, you, you goofed, kid. Yep. Oh my god, I did it again. You need to let me do this, because you're really bad at this part. I, I shouldn't be, is the problem. I know you shouldn't be, and I agree you shouldn't be. You need to let me do that oh part. Oh my god. I am not used to this anymore. You are not, sir. That's I'm... okay. When we come back from lunch, then uh, you'll be better. Yeah. You'll be gooder. -er. So, next episode, I'm just letting you know now. Next episode, I will be getting the Wave Buster. <laughs> um, as well as killing one of those large beetles. Um, it's a feature at this point. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I'm never going to live that down, alright? No, you're not. That is not the first time you have failed that. You are. I mean, on the bright side, it's a lot easier to grind for missiles in this one. Because enemies have much higher drop rates, but still. That's, that's just ridiculous. Like, if you just went and killed all of those beetles, you'd probably get, like, 20 missiles out of them. Not in the GameCube version. They no. will drop Nothing. purple energy things 9 out of 10 times. Yeah. Actually, it's probably more like 80 out of 10. But 80 out of 10 times? It's just, like, brrr, just spawning, like, millions of them at a time. <laughs> just spawns 8 per 1. <laughs> oh, God, that would be... That would be horrifying. I would be okay with that. I would too. Or just one yellow. It just spawns a yellow one every time you kill one of those. 
<laughs> that means you get 20 extra. <laughs> oh, God. Because the purples are worth 10 I HP. Know. I know. Okay. I'm just saying. Oh, that's right. We have the things, so we can go back in here now. Yay. You can go through here the second you get more qual. But yeah, but... Nobody cares. Yeah, we, we nobody ever does that, because it's just not efficient. I also discovered the most efficient way to get 100% in Prime Trilogy. It's called don't care about them until you are basically almost beating the game. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's, uh, it's a pretty nice, uh... It's a pretty nice way to deal with things. Yeah, I... Used... I remember this room! I think I did this the wrong way. Did you? Well... Nah, maybe not, because we can... We could probably get hey, up here. Hey, look, a spider ball track. Yep. And, uh, one of those cordite things that you can break with, uh, Two, actually, but yes. Yes, two that you can break with the super missile. Super missile! Oh, wasting more missiles, huh? Not even grabbing the missile missile thing. Missile we, we can do that. Wasting after. so many missiles. We can do that after. So many, many missiles, sir. Uh, mm, I'm so disappointed. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> you sound so depressed. I'm not depressed. I'm tired and frustrated. <laughs> I'm not frustrated at you either, is the problem. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm I frustrated know. at me. I getcha. I getcha. Trying to do the scan jump? Yeah, the dash jump? Yeah, they, they it, broke it, that. It doesn't work in this one. No. Well, it's really awkward in the second game to do dash, dash jump because you have to uh, lock on, and then as you dash jump, you have to hold R also. Why R? What does That's R do for you? That's just how it works. Well, in the GameCube, that's the look modifier, so you can look up and down. <laughs> oh. But, oh, okay. uh... Apparently, or it just breaks in a way. That's weird. It's super weird. I hate these guys. Oh, I hate them. Because they will, they, will, they will push you off without hesitation, sir. These things are the worst. They are. They're, like, impossible to kill. Like, for the entire game. Quite literally. Yeah. Actually, I think that is... True, and Paul. I mean, power, obviously, power bomb can break that's it. yeah. It's not true. There are things that can kill them, but those are things that you usually wouldn't want to use um, in the situations where you're against them. Mm -hmm. You know. Also, uh, you ready for Chozo ghosts? Because it looks like you're about to fight some. Yeah, this is the first time we've encountered them. That is true, and you are going to despise it. Okay, I'm I'm ready. I promise you. And I think technically they're not supposed to be here yet. No, they are. As we, soon as well, you kill Flogra. Well, in terms of triggers, yes, but in terms of lore, they're not. Because uh, what you have to do to unleash him upon the world is you. Oh yeah, the artifact room, huh? The shrine. Yeah. Yeah. Once you enter there, it releases a bunch of these guys, and it happens in a bunch of areas, but not here apparently. <laughs> Oh, they can take a beating. Yep, they you, can. you haven't been hit yet, but they they can. Yeah, this would be a lot easier if we had X-ray visor. But believe don't. it or not, they the they get harder after you get X-ray visor. Do they just like, like buff their HP or something? Uh, and damage. Oh. and speed. That's <laughs> <fun>. <laughs> so that's they just a, that's okay. Chozo Ghost evolved. Well, Chozo Ghost is now stronger. Chozo Ghost. This isn't even my final form. <laughs> <laughs> that joke, that joke is so overused. I don't never care. Gets I old. love that joke. I do too. It, but it it never gets old, no matter how overused it is. Mm -hmm. um, well, I, I was gonna bring up. I think the reason that those feel faster, they not, might not necessarily be faster. Yeah. With X Men Avengers, because when you're locking onto them, it whips your camera around because it doesn't unlock. That's true. Um, but I, I know, like, they they actually do move faster. If you don't switch into X-Ray, then they they still move faster when they dodge out of your okay. out of your lock. Because yeah. Yeah. they're mean and evil. Oh no, they hit you once! Oh. Yeah. You're just gonna dislike the Arboretum fight, that's for sure. The Arboretum cho or ghosts? Yeah, yeah. Cause those, uh, luckily, those are they, don't, they don't ways. lock the room for that one. At least, I'm not used to them locking the room. I think they might. I don't know. I wouldn't doubt it. It's been a long time since I... Retro I've... Studios 
is awesome, but they have made me angry in the past. Very, very angry. I, I can forgive them immediately. Hey, that door opened up. Yeah. Yay, that door was locked from the time we fought Flagra. Dang. And you just fell. Meh. Oh, dear. Oh, it's because you Isn't can't... it nice that the water doesn't lag you? Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> just matter of fact, yes. It yeah. is. I'm not in a position to be funny right now. Yeah, too frustrated. Well, it's uh, a little bit of that. A little, a little bit tired. Bit, yeah. He was up all night streaming. Wasn't up that long. Shh, quiet child. It's okay. Like an extra it's hour. okay to cry. Actually, no, I didn't sleep an extra hour because I, I went an hour <laughs> earlier to bed, and then <laughs> stared at the ceiling. No, then I woke up an hour earlier. Oh, that's true. So you I did, saved you? no time. You uh, you simply shifted a little bit. Shifted an hour. Just a little it's like bit. Like I moved time zones. We ah, uh, that was much less eventful than I expected it to be. It's way faster to be in the morph ball when you do that. Is it? Yes. Why is that? Does because morph ball fall you, faster? Um, no. No. The reason it's faster is because when you <laughs> land. Get wrecked by that moving platform, dude. It, it happens. Get wrecked. It doesn't actually do any damage. It did. No, it didn't. Why doesn't it do damage? <laughs> Why doesn't it do damage? It, it's just there to hinder you. That's silly. Yeah. It wrecked you, though. It wrecked your face. Yep. It's just like... Ugh! <laughs> that is exactly what happened. It just went... Ugh! And I missed that jump. Indeed you did. Uh, that, that one I can't give you crap for, though, because it's so dark. Uh, wow. Like, it's really notable, the difference between... Oh, yeah, it's... I can feel it. Like, I was watching the recording of me fumble around in the dark, and I was like, No! Asa, no! It's over there! <laughs> Asa! Asa, please! It's over there! <laughs> and I, it's like... Like, I don't, I don't think the viewer understands just how dark the... We're gonna have to take a... A picture or something. Yeah, like something. Because it's... It's a lot darker. I just... I, I, I'm i amazed that it is so much darker. Mm -hmm. Those lasers, though. Yeah. So... <clears throat> I, uh... I, my, one, of my, one of my friends... My dad's friend as well. Um, co-worker of my dad. Um, he's actually the one who lent me Metroid Prime Trilogy... Or Metroid Prime 3... And that is how I got started with the Metroid series. Um, and uh, he he asked me, "Is Metroid Other M any good?" Because I asked for it for Christmas, and I got it. And uh, and he he was like, has heard so many mixed reviews, but overall, most of them have called it bad. And I and I told him um, that I thought it was fun. I thought it was like an awesome game. And as soon as you get over the fact that Samus is whines constantly. <laughs> um, as soon as you get over that fact, it's well worth playing. And, and like, so I lent that out to him, so I haven't been able to start my, uh, my le solo Let's Play of it. Um, oh, that's right. I was like, wait, isn't that an artifact? No, wait, no, that was just the randomizer. <laughs> I corrupted you, I'm sorry. <sighs> you, you did corrupt me. Anyway. That randomizer is so fun, though. It, it was fun to watch, that's for sure, because sure, I was like, ha, 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 you're boned. <laughs> that's exactly how you should have responded to that. And... Are they not gonna... Nope, because we haven't gotten to the shrine yet. Oh. I don't remember which direction it was, and I need to stop pressing 2. I think it's, um... I think the reason it's... that they appeared in the flogger room is because you had access to the artifact. Yes. Well, it, it, they just are there by default. Yeah. It's I'm pretty sure if you leave the flogger room and then go back in, they'll be there. Like immediately. <laughs> I'm like I'm I'm pretty sure. Like the I the, wouldn't doubt it. There's weird triggers like that. Like uh, uh, killing a Metroid and the space pirate jumping through the wall. That that <laughs> one's like made to be that though. I know that that, but it's still silly. Are you gonna try to break the break the game and get up there? Oh, space jump. Right, that's a thing. 
<laughs> Were you thinking of the randomizer again? Yeah. When I spent like 15 minutes trying to get up there. And yeah, and it turned out just to be the wave beam, and you're like, oh, I don't want that. And I'm like, god damn you. I needed that one, though. Because yeah. the problem was like, continue. But it was too much effort, and I didn't want it. Yeah. Not even going to use the shortcut. So it's lazy. It's faster to not. So lazy. Yeah, it's it's re it's a really sad day when the shortcut is faster than the actual or er, when the, the actual route is faster. It's because of the, the duration of morph ball morph bomb. Morph ball bomb. Yeah. yeah. Also, the fact that you can just spam normal beam and the eyes will just be like, "Ow, ow, don't do that." And this is so much easier that, since you can flick it. Yeah, I I'm still and, gonna. And you still do it the legit way. I'm such keep, a pro. I, I want to keep such that a pro habit. player. I want to keep that habit. Yeah, that's fair enough. The ice beam door, though. Where is ice beam again? Is it in Fendrana? Nope. No, it's in Magor, isn't it? Chozo. 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 There is only one beam in Magor. That's plasma. You're not gonna scan the lore for the viewers. I forgot that there was lore in there. Yeah, and that's gonna end our episode too. Okay. So, I'm gonna have to find my way back to that room so that I can, um, so that I can finally do the, get the wave buster. It's Where did the meteor come from? <laughs> find out in Metroid Prime 3. Because they tell you where the meteor came from. They also tell you what the meteor is and why the Metroid Prime is in there. So that's fun. Yeah. Next time, more things.